Here we have a little golden book called Old MacDonald Had a Farm and I have turned it into a journal. It's a junk journal. You can see that there is a two inch spine. When I was taking the book apart I split the spine so I decided to make a wider spine for this book and you can see the back detail. There are corner um, edges, metal edges on the corners to protect it and this one has a ribbon closure. So let's take a look inside. Starting with the inside cover, we have a belly band and included in the belly band we have lots of different cutoffs that you can use inside the journal to decorate and be creative however you would like. And you can see this book has four signatures. So we've got one in the front with the story intact. This is a notebook that comes out. It has sketch paper inside and we'll get more in depth in a moment. This one is another notebook with just journaling paper and there's some sticker embellishments on the pages and lots of other things that we'll talk about. And then the final signature has the, the rest of the story intact with other pages and then the back cover. Starting with the first signature we've got story pages and we have themed paper that goes along with the book. There's some tea dyed, coffee dyed paper, writing paper, and some old school papers inside. Lined paper, some stenciled coffee dyed notebook paper, coloring pages, scientific note paper. This is a thicker cardstock with some stenciling, some school pages, and then the first signature is has linen thread that's uh, wax thread to secure the three hole pamphlet stitch. So that is the first signature. The book has a hidden spine where the first and last signatures are sewn in and then there is elastic in the middle so that these inserts can come out if you would like to take those out. And inside the first pocket we have a little embellished paper clip. And the first pocket inside the sketchbook is filled with tags that you can use to embellish or use with other things inside the journal. And a lot of these are double-sided, so there's um, a design on the front or the back. And then there's some extra tags included for writing spaces, or you can use them as tuck spots and pockets that you can glue onto the pages. In the back of this sketchbook, inside the back pocket, we have lots of other little goodies. There is a mini journal here with a little tuck spot. So there's a tiny journal that you can use for additional writing space. And then we have some other little tags and embellishments. This says, a garden is a delight to the eye and a solace for the soul. It's a little quote that was from a tea bag. We've got tags. This one says, one touch of nature makes the whole world kin, William Shakespeare quote. And then we've got additional journaling cards. use that as a belly band or just a embellishment.
The third signature is a notebook and it has writing paper and inside this pocket it has a full a fold out folio so you can see the front and the back and you can open it up it opens like this and flips out on both sides and it's just filled with additional cards and journaling spots Cute little recipe card. There's another pocket here, and this could be used to create journaling spots or add photos to it. Lots of different uh, things you can do. And then on the pages of the notebook, we have sticker embellishments throughout the book. In the back cover, inside the pocket, we have some other little ephemera that you can use throughout the book. Here's another mini notebook for extra journaling and writing. We've got some stickers, little tags, And then our last signature, we have some more coordinating papers to go with it. And the story, which is still intact, more coffee dyed paper, lined paper. writing paper, coloring spot, And in the back cover, we have a little pocket with some other stickers and embellishments. These are tags made from recycled cardboard that you can fold in half and make little tabs inside the book if you would like. We've got some stickers. And this is just a fold out page, an additional writing space that you can use. And that's the back cover and then 
the ribbon closure that you can just tie back up. So that's the Little Golden Book Altered Book Junk Journal. I hope you enjoyed watching and if you are interested in purchasing you can check out my Etsy shop in the links below. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.